Hello. Hi. We always start that way. Okay. It well, is. Well, then let's change it. Okay. Hello. Whatever. <laughs> How's that? Cheers. Okay. Yeah. Yes. We'll start cheers off. With to cheers to new beginnings. There we go. And now we you can't have talk. Our... You can't talk. I know. I do. Do your cheers. And then yes. you. And uh, yeah, because you're supposed to look people in the eye when you when you clink. Okay, um, otherwise it doesn't count. Whatever counts. Okay, it is Body and Blood weekend. Corpus Christi and all that. Okay, so Body and Blood. Here's our here's the bread and wine. Here's our wine. Okay, and sherry has got a good one this oh time. Oh my gosh, this is really good. Okay, and I know you know. I'm I'm going off the subject, but that's just kind of what I do. We do we do. But I do have to tell I do have to tell you about this darn yummy wine. It's called Matt Parrish and is a Cabernet Sauvignon out of Napa Valley, Napa Valley, and it is delicious. I we, I just uh, opened our first bottle of it upstairs. And, and what's uh, your wine club? Naked Wines. Okay. There's there's two. There's Naked Wines and there's First Leaf Wine Club. Okay. Yeah, and they deliver these. Really interesting wines from smaller uh, vintages and I mean smaller uh, wineries and and uh, uh, this thumbs up. So they now are, I know this isn't a wine review. Yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> but hey, we, we we make up the rules for these things as we go. Yeah, we do. But goodness, that is beautiful. That's serious. I like it. Very, she very didn't want to nice, waste it nice on me. Fruity bouquet. Oh, that, that's not that I want to. I, wanna, I was, wanna waste well, it. Well, I was going to explain, okay, but because ahead. my taste is usually, you know, I can't tell the difference between, a, say, a nineteen dollar one and a forty dollar one. I mean, so yeah. <laughs> she's like, if you but can't I tell can. the difference, I'm not going to waste it. <laughs> yeah. But immediately when he took a sip, he was like, "Oh my gosh, that's this is flavorful." flavorful yeah. So that tells me you can tell the I difference. I can. Okay. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, so that's all. <laughs> Let's move on. Yes. I think that was about 10 minutes right there, Gene. Yeah. Okay, video's done. All right. Back to anyway. church. <laughs> anyway, it is, uh, th these are some songs for Body and Blood. And since we're having wine, it's just going to be a relaxing uh, set of songs. Just a, 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 a trio, yeah. a trinity of songs. Uh, uh, didn't you make that joke that, last week? During Trinity Sunday, yes. Okay. Uh, anyway, but um, we're just going to do three songs, but these are... What, what did Bullwinkle say? I need to get me a new hat. <laughs> <laughs> Again! <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway. Oh. And, this, and we just, we've only had like four sips. Yep. But we I just got back from a wedding, so that's why I'm dressed, but shares. I just house. got back from a wedding too, but I came home because we were going to have curry. This curry and really curry. good curry called Curry in a Hurry. Never heard of it. My sister just told us about it. She texted. And it was really good and inexpensive. And there you go. So I guess, you know, maybe we need to put reviews in like on every other day. I would do, say people I think care. you would. I think you would really do good at that uh, because you're really good at coupons and reviewing oh, things. Oh, I'm a coupon king. Yeah. So, anyway, yes. let's move on. If I think of it, sure, I'll throw those things in. But, but you're wearing um, the shirt from our... I am. When we went to the Eclipse yes. in Lincoln, down yes. with Julie Schoenweiss. And that was really nice. That was that was in uh, 2017. It was. Yeah. A long time ago. Yeah. We just, you know. Here we go. <laughs> um, so, in honor of Body and Blood, so we picked it's real three very common ones that we like to do during that. So you'll probably hear those. At the masses we sing anyway, but since some mm -hmm. of you can't come to the masses, this is why we're bringing this to you. And uh, the first one we'd like to do is, this is an arrangement that we did of an old American folk song. Mm -hmm. And I think the first time I ever heard this song was from Joan Baez, believe it or not. Um, I was went, it? I saw her okay. in concert here in Omaha, mm -hmm. and I got to meet her afterwards, you know, and... Uh, <laughs> But anyway, she sang this in, in her concert, and the whole audience joined in. Um, oh, that's cool. But, uh, but uh, you know, a completely out-of-church out of setting. Yeah. So we do this with our choirs. Um, completely uh, out-of-church settings? Huh? What? We do what with our choirs? A completely we do this song. Out of, oh. No. I'm saying she did this okay. out-of-church setting. <laughs> now, back to church settings. Huh? Our choirs, we, we do this song. Let us break bread together. Let us break bread together on our knees. Let us break bread together. Oh, 
us drink wine together on our knees. Let us drink wine together. so pretty simple little tune yeah huh? it's really nice i don't have my guitar with me today by the way just because um i'm really enjoying having <laughs> a nice glass of wine having drinking wine yes. not on your knees not though. on my knees yes yeah. um but like Jean said we just got back from a wedding and i'd left upstairs i <laughs> you left one upstairs i left my guitar upstairs oh Whatever. Yeah, whatever. You usually don't play on this one anyway because you just like to sing it. No, I know. I usually okay. do play on this. Oh, you do? Yeah. Okay. Because right. it's a folky tune. No, this next one. Oh, this next one. No, I don't. Yeah. So. Yeah. Oh, and and Joanne would Joanne would like to know that. You know, Watch the wine. I do. I am. She likes to see if I have some fun socks on. I think these are fun socks. They're minty. They're minty. Sure. All right. Uh, you ready? Uh, yeah, I just want to do that. And I'm, I'm not playing any drums tonight, but because I don't have a uh, place for my wine, I got to get those little beats in there. All right. I'm ready. All right. So, you want to say anything about this or you just do it? I'll just do it. All right. Well... It is written by Twyla Paris, I okay. will say that. And she deserves some <laughs> tremendous credit for this song because it's a gorgeous tune. It's one of our favorites. We've done it a few times um, on our uh, live stream masses that we've, uh, like, down at Sacred Heart, out at uh, St. Pat's. I know they both, each one of them had this on there at least once. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. We, we likes it. Yeah. How beautiful the hands that served The wine and the bread and the sons of the earth How beautiful the feet that walked The long dusty road and the hill to the cross How beautiful Is 
the body of Christ, and as he These little tunes down here. Yeah. So I was thinking, you know, when we, we, every time we say wine, everyone should just take a sip. <laughs> make make a drinking game no, out, of our, not what I mean. out of our church you know, yeah. videos. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, we know those Catholics. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. One more tune for you. Yeah. This one we did a couple weeks ago, but um, but we did it in um, in its kind of like rock pop format. Um, and um, so that's kind of how the song started off and when I wrote it. And uh, Everybody say hi to my hubby. Bye. 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 So, Bye. <laughs> um, and so then I added verses to it. Um, and, and then eventually, it some, sometimes I just needed a more of meditative version of it. Mm -hmm. So I've actually used this, what I call the reprise version of it. Um, and it's just the, the chorus and bridge and chorus again. Uh, of the song called For I Am the Bread of Life. And this song in the first place came about because, okay, a long time ago. When I was in the third grade. The third, okay, we, I am the, the song I Am the Bread of Life mm -hmm. is a song that you could probably use any weekend. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. any weekend, uh, and it's probably appropriate. Um, and, uh, but we just kind of, kind of got tired of always using it and and I wasn't a big fan of the song that much I love the chorus but I was was that be what was that before we yes did our arrangement and then we came up with some fun echoes and I went okay oh, now yeah. I understand we have a really really nice arrangement of it yeah yeah so the, that's we're talking about the eye on the bread of life and now now we just love doing that song. and that song means a lot to me even though i think the 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 verses are a little clunky but i think but but the chorus is is so sailing i mean it's just like you know but it was clunky because you know what the way when you hear this at church sometimes, sometimes it's yeah. because it's just some some horrible singer singing about hey, it or something. I don't, don't, know. don't say that i'm just okay i'm just i'm just saying there are times when you hear something and that's and, true and they're just plowing through the song without any feeling and right. and, and that can actually bring a sour taste to a song. And but then, this wine does not bring a sour taste to anything. No. But no, but you know why I like that song though? Mm -hmm. Because that was one of grandma's grandma Closer's okay, favorite yeah. songs. And every time I sing that I get a little choked up because mm -hmm. we sang that at her funeral. Mm -hmm. And and so, you know, even despite the verses, 
That chorus but I, but was I, but beautiful. But see, I love the verses now. I mean, I, well, like, I now, now I understand. Yeah. yeah, but we didn't, no, whatever. We added some echoes and cool things. So one day you'll hear our uh, choir do this <gasps> yeah. uh, to do that song, I Am a Bread of Life. But I just I didn't always want... hear. I always hear one in Alejandra singing. On this on that on one? On How Beautiful, on, on okay. this one, one on, on The Echo is With Me, on I'm the Bread of Life. Yeah. Yeah. And, and our, our choir kids from Paramount. And those are the ones we taught it to in the first place. Yes. And so then we finally wrote it out and taught it to St. E's Choir, St. Elizabeth, and St. Pat's Choir. And, and our men's choir, and our yeah. youth choir, and our teen so choirs. Fun. Yeah, it was nice. So anyway, that, that, okay, we keep going back and forth. That's I Am the Bread of Life. Okay, but in a need for just a different uh, take on uh, that same subject mm -hmm. I came up with uh, Fry on the Bread of Life mm -hmm. and um, so we can do it in a like I said rock, rock pop format right um, with a full whatever full choir etc right. and um, then you can do it in this version and that's and so we have a lot of choices yeah for that that's kind of how this came about and now we just enjoy doing them all absolutely all right so uh, here is the reprise version of For I Am the Bread of Life Answer the call of my father, hear his voice in the thunder. If you believe in me, you will not hunger. Just drink of the living water, and you will never die. And I will take you to my Father for I, I am the bread of life. Okay, I got one last sip. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Ding. Ding. Clinker. Enjoy your night or day. <laughs>